check out what I found. It's a nice little kitty cat 308 swing boom rubber tracks like clip on rubber pads on the steel tracks 18 rated operating weight of 18,500 uh, I think she's got right around 1500 hours drat the woods they're always out to get you just, just now one of them hooked into my hat tried to hold me back so I'm fixing up this old logging road and this is halfway up one mountain sitting on top of another one some bullshit like that there's rocks and just you name it it's it's brutal ground wasn't gonna work to bring the track machine in here try to fix this up so convince the man in the office <laughs> That's just a machine for the job, and it is. It is this, this uh, the skitter machine plowed in ruts and furrowed dirt along the lower edge of the trail. And I'm going along, pulling that back, grabbed hold of a log, and smooth everything out. And we're working our merry way across the face of creation. That is an impressive little beast, as well. I think I really like this little machine. See if we can get a video of it. There we go.
one minor flaw with this machine. It's got a stupid mechanical thumb. Oh, I'm frustrated by that thing. Oh, but that makes a good operator out of you. <laughs> yeah, yeah, sure it does. Sure it does. This is a Rendell. Yeah, that's what Rendell machines look like. Can't have anything nice in a Rendell. At least it doesn't leak. Not that I know of, anyway. That was a nice hit there. That was a beautiful hit. How do you even do that? Well, I guess you shouldn't ask too much. Even though, look at this. Look at this. There once was a window right there. Yep. Thanks to the mechanical thumb. Yes, sir. One somehow that uh, solid thumb is to blame for taking that window out. Somehow it, uh, crap, I don't even remember how it happened. There's, there's one tree intertwined with another one, and somehow when I grab one of them, you can't barely get two of them with a... Uh, solid thumb so when I grabbed hold of one of them the other one released sudden pressure and came smacking up against the side of my cab and if you'd have had a hydraulic thumb as all excavators are supposed to have that wouldn't have happened because you just grabbed the both of them and no pressure at all the other one would have relieved itself and I would have had it under control well I should ought to get in here See if we can't. Scared the crap out of me anyway when that one went. Yeah, you see on. Feels like Miami in here today. Let's see if we can get a little video from inside here. I don't have any way of holding my camera in here. Just to run the controls and control the video. I can't multitask. <laughs> oh well, I'm gonna continue trucking my little log over this bumpy ass trail and smooth it out a little bit and hope the forester guy is happy with it. Keep your diggers dirty.